Hi everyone, I'm going to walk you through how to do independent reading with your child and submit it on Google Classroom. So first what you're going to do is go to the Classwork tab and you'll see the independent reading assignment. You can click on it and then go down to View Assignment. And over here you'll see the directions for exactly what you want to do. The first thing you'll need to do is to log into Raz Kids using Clever. So you will navigate back to Clever and you'll see the Raz Kids app icon, which looks like this, this little robot, and you will click on that. It might ask you to confirm your child's email account. So just click on that. And when they log in, they'll see this. You can just ignore Headsprout for right now. We're not using that right now. Where your child will want to go is reading. So once they are in reading, they are going to spend their time here in the reading room. This level up section, they may go to later, but they should only go there if their teacher tells them to go there. So right now, all kids should be going to the reading room to spend most of their time. So they can click on the reading room. And when it opens up, you will see lots of different books. These books are on their reading level, so they're the right level for them to be reading independently or by themselves. So when you go to the books, you can see there are some different options here. The child can listen to the book, they can read the book, and then they can answer some questions or do a comprehension quiz after the, they're done reading the book. What we want kids to do primarily is to be reading the book. If they want to go back and listen to it when they're done, that's fine, but we really want them to spend most of their time reading independently. For kindergarten and first graders, they should be reading at least two new books every day during independent reading time. They should be reading for about 20 to 30 minutes. So after they read those two new books, they can go back and reread old books. Rereading is really good for fluency and for comprehension, so we definitely recommend that. But they should get at least two new books every day to make sure they're getting that practice in. The comprehension quizzes for kindergarten and first grade are not required. They can do them if they want to do them, but they don't have to do them. For second, third, and fourth grade, we expect kids to read at least one new book every day and complete all of the comprehension quiz that goes with that book. So the comprehension quiz is required if your child's in second, third, or fourth grade. So once your child does their reading on Raz Kids, you can go back to Google Classroom and you will just click over here, click Mark is done. Click Mark is done. And then your child's teacher will see that they've done their reading for the day in Raz Kids. So that shows you how to use Google Classroom and navigate over to Raz Kids to use that for your child to complete their independent reading. 